so Mickey started the game against Leicestershire and, and while maybe the start of day three you were thinking pushing ahead for a win, Benton in a draw, we have entered and beaten at home. So there are positives to take from that. Yeah, they, they, you know, there's lots of positives this season. I think we, we can count numerous games where, getting to the last day, we were the we, we were the only team that could win it. So we were we were setting up games, putting ourselves in a position to to win games, and just not getting over the line. And um, that's something we, we we can obviously work on. The positives from that is we were getting ourselves in those positions. Obviously, for us, the next work on is is getting over the line in those games. But really, really happy, very, very proud of, of the way the guys have gone about the season. You know, they've rocked on every day wanting to get better and that's all that's all a, a, a head coach can ask. A couple of individual milestones being told. Firstly, Wayne Madsen leading Cash Championship run scorer across both divisions. I mean, that's some, some accolade for him, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, it's, a, it's, a, it's an amazing accolade. It, it, it really is. Um, yeah, he's just He's like a, as I saw saw last night's people were saying, he's like a mature red wine. You know, he just gets better and better and better. But it's 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 not through coincidence. You know, he gets in every day and he works so hard. And when he comes to training, he trains hard. He trains properly. Um, so it's not coincidence that that happens. And he puts in a hell of a lot of work away from the prying eye. Um, so that when he gets out there, um, he he's capable of producing those match-winning performances for us. So he's had another fantastic year. Yeah, Sam Connors as well reached 50 championship points for the season on the final day. You've said before that he's had to kind of burden some of the load kicking him with Saranga going down earlier this season. And he's got just rewards for that, hasn't he? He has. He, he, he's, he has got just a he, he deserved to get his 50 wickets today. It's been a yeoman service from him. He's, he's every day rocked and he's played a lot more cricket than he or I would have thought he would have, um, you know, when we did our, our pre-season planning. But he's never shirked. He's running and was running hard every day, of, virtually of the season. Um, and he, he fully deserves that accolade of 50 wickets. Yeah, and it's the end of your first season in county cricket. Hmm. There's a lot said about county cricket a lot of the time. But from your point of view, how have you found the first year in English cricket? Yeah, I, I've really enjoyed it. I've really, really enjoyed it. Then there is a lot said about county cricket, and I can honestly say I've, I've looked at first-class structures around the world. I've been involved in, in, in first-class structures all around the world. Um, every country, perhaps by India and New Zealand, and the, the county the, 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 the county system is is very, very good. It's, a, it's always a lot maligned, but it's a very, very good system. And I mean, there, there's been some fantastic cricket played, and there's been some some, some fantastic games. So um, it's also the fabric of the summer, and 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 you can never take that for granted. So uh, county cricket, in my opinion, is is in a really good place.